Peeping toms have been around since Lady Godiva was riding around naked on horseback. And while tiny cameras can make it easier for creeps to spy, they've also made it possible to nab some of those voyeurs and prosecute them. Lisa Guerrero reports. It's a disgusting invasion of privacy. Creepy guys peeking into your window without you ever knowing. This 36-year-old businessman from Colorado was caught red-handed looking inside a 17-year-old girl's bedroom window. And this guy has the nerve to take a chair to get a better look inside a bathroom window. By the way, he's a registered sex offender from New Jersey. These creeps often use the cover of darkness thinking no one can see them while they're spying on you. Little do they know, some homeowners have turned the tables and are recording them. Often that's the only way these peeping toms will ever get caught. I would hear a male voice and it sounded like moaning coming from right here. For three weeks, 29-year-old Noelle Bracey heard strange noises outside her window as she was getting ready to head out to work. All I could see was him silhouetted. So I saw his head and then his shoulders and he was staring straight at me. That's when she bought a camera. Two days later, the peeping Tom was caught on tape. He's literally looking at a tiny little hole and peeping at me while I'm tooting. He sees the camera light turning on, and so he immediately turns around and walks away. The peeping Tom is still on the loose. <gasps> there he is. That's Ooh. him sneaking in. This homeowner from New Mexico caught a peeping Tom staring into a window on the side of his home. And whose window is that? Uh, my 16-year-old daughter's window. <laughs> oh, no. What the peeper didn't know was that this father of three has eight cameras monitoring his property. Even though he had a hoodie on, that camera was able to capture all the way from his eyes to the bottom of his face because you could actually see him blinking. Yes. Neighbors in this upscale community were shocked to learn the identity of the peeper. He's a former deputy with the local sheriff's department. Ventura Salas pleaded no contest. Now we come to this guy. He wasn't satisfied peeping into a young child's bedroom. He actually climbed a wall to get a better look into the bathroom. Each time they do this, and there's no repercussions, they become more and more brazen. District Attorney Tim Ward. You're not saying every peeping Tom no. is going to escalate to no, something not more, more violent, but you're saying it's possible. It's possible. I caught up with the accused peeper. He's on trial today and has pleaded not guilty. What were you doing there? Sir, are you a peeping Tom? For these homeowners, there is a sense of relief that they were able to turn the tables on the slimy creeps who violated their privacy in such depraved ways. He invaded my privacy and he took my sense of um, security away. Penalties for peeping toms vary widely, but they usually result in fines and less than a year in jail. That deputy sheriff pled no contest to peeping. He'll be sentenced the end of the month.